Hello Internet, this is another disassembly video. Uh, this is uh, a Asus uh, RX580 uh, 8GB model. Uh, specifically, it's the dual OC uh, version. Uh, pretty simple. If you remember from my previous videos, this goes in par with uh, the uh, MSI Armor series. Uh, so it has a pretty basic uh, layout and pretty basic design. As you can see, there's no backplate and uh, a lot of the internal um, uh, components don't make any contact uh, besides the GPU core uh, to the heatsink and that's all about it. So, uh, as we said in previous videos, there are uh, cheaper versions of graphics cards for all the wallets. Uh, the MSI uh, Armor version is the cheapest of them and the equivalent for ASUS uh, is this uh, dual OC version. Uh, so I've uh, cleaned and disassembled uh, prior to the card, otherwise the card, as you can see, uh, the seal is still on, but um, <laughs> to look uh, uh, underneath what's going on. Uh, so, and time to make the video happen. Um, yeah, pretty much straightforward. As you can see, there are four retention uh, screws. The GPU uh, dies under here, and uh, these two screws uh, hold up the VRM components uh, um, and they have a, a unique um, a specialized a heat sink uh, uh, underneath them uh, so uh, they are providing their own coolant, uh, cooling and uh, while providing power to the GPU um, and that's all about it so uh, just gonna uh, un unscrew uh, the screws <laughs> here and uh, hopefully we can name some of the uh, components underneath the four retention screws are done we lift slowly the GPU and that's the graphics card it itself uh, so the paste is uh, brand new I, I think I put a little bit too much on it but hey uh, and as you can see um, just the GPU uh, core is uh, touching uh, the heatsink and the fins the rest of the card is being cooled by the air coming through the fans uh, as a pass-through so it's just air cooling uh, this uh, part here is the separate heat sink underneath uh, the VRM providing uh, the necessary uh, voltage uh, and power towards the core. Uh, uh, the um, uh, VRAM uh, chips, the memory chips, uh, usually on other cards there is a specialized uh, base plate covering all this and providing extra heat dissipation not here uh, everything's uh, air cooled um, so the and as far as uh, if I can try uh, distinguish this should be the display uh, rail here um, either of these two should be memory uh, this is definitely the VRM uh, despite how hard I tried I couldn't get uh, this uh, uh, des uh, a separate heatsink off uh, it seems the, um, to be honest, the uh, RX500 uh, uh, series is a bit old at this point, so uh, this was never taken off, and this is the original pads underneath, so uh, I couldn't try uh, lift it, so I better uh, left it uh, on its own, um, and uh, yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna unscrew this, there's just little, the two screws that I mentioned uh, before. Uh, holding this separate uh, heatsink underneath um, and there's nothing else uh, the VRM uh, power chokes the capacitors uh, filtering uh, capacitors um, uh, so uh, yeah this should be uh, this should be VDDCI this should be memory if somebody knows better please 
uh, let me know. Um, and on the back we should see somewhere 1.8 volts and 5 volts, but I'm not familiar with this card uh, yet, uh, so I couldn't uh, tell. This seems like the BIOS chip here, uh, but I cannot distinguish any other uh, voltage regulators. To be uh, to be honest, ASUS is um, uh, quite distinct. You can see they use these pretty nice uh, chokes here, uh, but uh, couldn't see. Uh, I need to research uh, a bit on this card to see where the uh, five volt and one point eight volts are. But uh, yeah, that's it with this card. Nothing special. Um, uh, let me know what what you think, uh, any suggestions about future videos or anything. Obviously, I'm continuing on the background doing the diagnosing uh, videos, but I'm not having much uh, luck so far. Uh, but still, it's a nice uh, hobby uh, um, and it's uh, worth the while. You uh, learn uh, a lot of things. Um, but yeah, that's it for this one. Um, Again, if you have any suggestions or uh, questions, please uh, put them below. That's it for this one. Thank you very much. See you on the next one.